Has anybody here, uh, does anybody know what the new two most powerful words in any language are? Mm -hmm. I am. I am. Yeah, Very good. Go, you guys. On that note, what's the two, second two most powerful? I am. Close. It's you are. For affecting people. For affecting people and affecting yourself. The I am, what happens is when you declare the, put in the I am, the reticular activating system goes for looking for evidence to back up whatever you just said. It's been programmed to look for that. The you are, you want to be really careful. It's anytime you're using the you are, you're helping to find somebody else's self-image. So what I'm going to do is, part of what I did today is I just programmed your reticular activating system to listen to how other people speak or even how you speak to yourself. There's the old saying, if I, you know, if I spoke to my friends the way I speak to myself, I wouldn't have any, right? Yeah. So we'll look at some of these. The you are, think about this, when you cringe sometimes when you hear how people speak to their kids. When you call yes. them you are a, is that truly the image that you want them to carry through life with because it will do that for them, right? Now the I am, has anybody here ever used affirmations? Okay. So first off, what is an ac your, affirmation? Your wife knows you're here. So My wife knows yeah. me here. All right, so what's an affirmation? A positive statement. That's an ideal affirmation. Affirmation just means you are affirming something. So if I say, I am stupid, I am disorganized, that's an affirmation. I'm just affirming something, right? And it will, again, the reticular activating system will go looking for evidence to back up I'm stupid. Will it find evidence? Oh, absolutely. If it goes looking, it's going to find evidence where I've done it. It has to go back in many, many years, but it will find something, right? So that won't work for us. All right, so from an affirmation point of view, has anybody here ever used affirmations? Yeah. Okay, how many have had great success with them? Okay, how many have had mm, success with them? Yep. You can get both sides going on. Now, Dan was talking about your subconscious here, in that the, when you set a goal, Stuff starts to rise to the surface, right? So sometimes your, your, your goal is to get stuff in here so they can rise to the surface. So that's the idea of an affirmation is to push stuff through there. Now, some people will use an affirmation, and usually it's something out there that you want part of your world. Right? And you see somebody will use the affirmation. Uh, a real common one is, I'm too sexy for my clothes. We'll run with that one, right? So you'll say something, does it feel truthful to you? Yes. One person the felt it was, he was too sexy for his clothes, okay? <laughs> <I'm talking about. laughs> but quite often we'll say an affirmation that doesn't ring true, but we're told if you keep repeating it, it's going to pound its way through that little barrier, maybe, eventually, but most people will give up before it ever gets there, only because it just doesn't feel right. So what I'm going to show with you is, I'm going to call it, it's, called, it's a piggyback method. Yeah, great. All right, we use a methodology, it's a piggyback method. Great technique. And it is called Four Truths. New truth. And I think we call it affirmation four in the bottom of your yeah. book on page five. All right, so what we're going to, how we, this will work is we use, I need a volunteer. Okay, no one at a time. Oh, yeah. Sean. Sure. Thank Sean. you, sir. All right, Sean. Fallen told. First, we're going to, uh, we're going to establish some truths. Okay, we need, we need the truths. All right, we'll start with the I am. Um, now you are amongst friends, so you're willing to, you can share your information here. Are you a man? Yes. All right. Okay, and your name is? Sean. How do I spell that? S-H-A-U-N. Okay, so my name. All right. Um, where do you live? In Kelowna? Kelowna. Kelowna. Is two plus two four? Yes. You sure? Absolutely. All right. Let's check. Why am I glad he said absolutely? Because he has no doubt. Certainty. That's what I'm looking for, the certainty behind it. Are you certain you're a man? Yes. All right. Are you certain your name is Sean? Absolutely. Are you certain you live in Kelowna? Yes. Are you certain that two plus two is four? Yes. All right. These are truths. Right. All right. What would be a new truth that you'd like to have? Would be your goal. Your new What's paradigm? a goal? What's, what are you It can be, it be, it we'll use anything. We, we will say multimillionaire, whatever you want. You okay. um, successful aviation 
Okay. Is there anything, anything in particular that you would want as it, from a career point? Any job? Just want to be known in the industry as a leader in this. It's an unmanned aerial vehicle. Basically. All right, we could actually go with that. Known in the industry. For what? So let, we'll flip back. Let's imagine that you are known in the industry for unmanned vehicles. All right, you're well known, you're well respected. Well, how would that change how your day goes? Fantastic. Fantastic. That's why we want this to be the new truth for you. And you can say it with absolute certainty anytime it comes up, right? Because it changes how we approach life. All right, so the first thing we do is our, this is our, our base set. Now we're going to kick it up a notch, all right? So you would write these things out. The next thing you're going to step in here is we change it to. All right, first time you went through, I, I am a man, my name is Sean, I live in Kelowna, two plus two is four, I am known in the industry, I'm successful, I'm known in the industry in, for this. All right, that's your new truth. All right, now we go to, I, do you believe you're a man? Do you believe your name is Sean? Yes. Do you believe you live in Kelowna? Yes. Do you believe that two plus two is four? Yes. All right, that's the next step. We'll kick it up another notch. Now we're bumping you up to no. I know I am a man. I know my name is Sean. I know I live in Colorado. I know that two plus two is four. I know I am known in the industry. Do you feel the difference? Yes. The energy should be coming up. So this becomes your new mantra, and what it does is it piggybacks its way through the system. All right, because it's said with such conviction, because the other one is tough to say when you don't believe it, but we'll just piggyback it along. Does this make sense? Yes. All right, it's a simple, simple exercise. So what I'm gonna get you to do in your book is to write out your first set of four truths and then add a new truth in there. And I recommend you use some easy ones like this to slide in here and come up with your new truth in there. So do that for me right now. Okay, now what I'll get you to do is to break into pairs. Actually, no, I'm lying through my teeth. <laughs> I want each of you to share with your group. So each of you will take a turn in your group and share your four truths and your new truth, please. Each of you will take a turn in your group and share your four truths and your new truth, please. Yeah, the idea is you, you got your four truths. These are things you know with yeah. beyond a shadow of a doubt. Now we need to slide the new truth in because our goal is to make that beyond a shadow of a doubt, right? Okay. Now one of the things I recommend that you do, simple enough to do is, is I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask everybody to go get one of these. This is basically, it's an evidence journal. So what you're doing is you can uh, the goal goes in here. You can also, your questions that you're going to be asking yourself on a, on a regular basis goes in here. And as the evidence starts to show up, you know, the reticular activating starts sending you information, write it down. Because every time you do that, the faith goes up and the steps become easier from that point on. The, I'm going to teach you, we'll go back to the book. I'm now just going to go over the information so that you can reinforce it in the book for and you. I'll put this up on the wall for